Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I am Dr. Imran Mir. Today's topic of discussion is how to do self branding. I am a brand. Self branding, creating a personal brand. When we think about a brand, usually products like iPhone, BMW, Mercedes come to our mind. But the concept of brand is not limited to products and services, it also applies to human beings. Think about celebrities, public figures, well-known personalities, businessmen, politicians, all of them have created a personal brand. So, celebrity can be defined as creating a unique and positive identity and unforgettable image in the people's mind around you. A personal brand represents what is best in you. How to do personal branding or celebrity? Self-branding does not happen automatically. You have to create it or in other words, you have to earn your place in a group of people, organization or society. Recall, when you are a student, what you used to do in order to get good grades, to impress your teachers and class fellows, buttery, flattery? No, of course not. You used to do hard work. Recall, you are not good in every subject. It means you have to highlight your key strengths or areas in which you have expertise or in which you are the master. Recall, you are not liked or everyone was not impressed by you. It means you cannot be a brand for everyone. You have to define your target audience to whom you want to promote your personal brand. In short, self branding is just like as you do at college or university. You want to be recognized by everyone around you. You want others to follow you. You want others to talk about you. You want to be prominent and well reputed. Technically speaking, three steps involved in self branding or in creating a personal brand. One, create self identity. Ensure that people know you. Use social media or peer to peer interactions to make yourself known to everyone around you. Two, define your target audience and share your story with them. You can't be a brand for everyone. You need to define your target audience. Think for a while about pet sellers. You will find pet shops only in those areas where there are pet lovers. Similarly, if you are target audience is job providers. Make your presence on job seeking websites or LinkedIn. Identify your key strengths, skills, experiences and develop a story around them. Share that story with your target audience. Three. Make your relationship with your target audience memorable or unforgettable. Deepen your relationship with your target audience by providing more information about you over time. Why you need to create a personal brand or why you need self-branding? If you Google the internet, you will find sufficient expert content on this topic, but I see it different in a different way. Almost all of us have gone through job interviews. Almost in all interviews, three questions are common. One, who are you? Interviewers ask us for our identity. Two, what are you? Interviewers ask us for our qualities, attributes, skills, experiences and so on. 
three what can do what what you can do for us or for our organization if you have already created a personal brand no one will ask you these three questions people and organizations would approach you with offers if you are thinking to create a personal brand i would suggest to you to read biographies real life stories watch interviews and documentaries about successful people it will give you a it will give you a hint how to start self brand this was today's topic see you soon in the new topic please do not forget to subscribe this channel and like this video allah hafiz